outbreaks of Ebola are rare. Um, you know, typically they occur in third world countries, um, and uh, in most cases, um, you know, it, it's just been relatively, uh, you know, it's been easy to control. And, and, and this is a very unique outbreak, however, in West Africa, very different than some of the other uh, outbreaks, and there have been problems. So I think, you know, I think we should be on alert. I don't want to cause panic, but I do think that, you know, people do need to be concerned and pay attention to it, particularly those in public health uh, professions and things like that. It's not transmitted through the air, at least the data and the knowledge that we have today uh, suggests that, that Ebola is not airborne. It's not like influenza or flu. The reservoir host in, in, in Africa is bats, and it's been associated with the consumption of bushmeat. So I think it's, it's mostly, the people that are most risk are if you're traveling to a rural area where, you know, uh, some of these cultural practices like, you know, the consumption of bushmeat or uh, bat soup or something like that, uh, that would probably be wise not to do that.